I was introduced to Catholic Charities through Boston Medical Center and receiving my prenatal care, I was informed to talk to Catholic Charities. They've helped me find resources on receiving extra diapers if I couldn't afford to get them at the time or extra clothing for my child if I needed the help. Before Catholic Charities was brought into my life, I was a mom, nervous, getting ready to have a baby and I didn't know anything about taking care of a child. I was only 19, I only had a little bit of support, my child's father wasn't really there. So it kind of brought me down and I was really worried. So I just went to the clinic and I was like talking to my doctor and asking for help finding resources and her main resource was Catholic Charities. They are a major support system and they're more than a support system. They're like a family. It's like one big happy family. My personal journey began with having my son. And after my son, I made a promise that I would go back to school. Regardless of me being a young single mom, I made sure that school was my top priority with the baby. And being with Catholic Charities, I was able to find my way to getting back into school and get the resources that I need. And with me going back to school, I was a recent graduate of June 2015 from class MOA at Lincoln Tech. I also obtained my learner's permit for driving with Catholic Charities help, of course. Also, I was placed in a really, really tough shelter at one point in time. And it was to the point where I felt like I was a bad mom because I couldn't give my child the exact home that I wanted him to have, a better place, somewhere where he's happy and he's healthy. And it was a real struggle for me. But then with hope and the encouragement that I have from a lot of my supporters from Catholic Charities, I was able to obtain somewhere safe and clean and sanitary and healthy for my child. So it's been one hectic journey, but it's all well worth it. That's a lot of nights that I've stayed up and cried and just prayed for the best for my baby because I always want him to have what's best. I always want him to be happy. If he's happy, then I'm happy. But I feel like if something's not going right in his favor, I feel like it's tough because I feel like he can feel that world and I want him to be happy at home.